my name is Natasha Howes and I'm a curator at Manchester Art Gallery. This is my first blog posting for We Face Forward, West African Art Today. I'm really excited to be here to tell you about this show, which opens on the 1st of June. I've been working on it for nearly a year now and I'm one of the curators involved, working across three venues in Manchester. We're working very closely with the Whitworth Art Gallery and some of the works will also be shown at the Gallery of Costume at Platt Hall. It's a huge team that's working on this major production and what I thought I'd talk to you about today is about how we go, around, go about organising a show of this scale. We're working with 30 artists from West Africa, from over nine countries in West Africa. And it's a huge organisational challenge to be in touch with all these artists, many of whom are French speakers, and also to be uh, arranging for their works to be brought to Manchester from all over the world, not only from West Africa, but also we're picking up work from America and Germany and Paris and Belgium too, which I think shows how sort of truly international a lot of these, um, a lot of these artists are. One of the pieces that I thought I would talk about, which I'm most excited about, is a brand new commission which we're having at Manchester Art Gallery. It's a piece by Bartolome Toguo, who is an artist uh, originally from Cameroon, and he is making a new piece called Redemption, which is going to consist of two enormous chairs. They're nearly five metres high. On one chair will be lots of bags, baggages, um, bags that you would uh, carry your clothing and your possessions around with you. And on the other chair, the other chair will be empty except for having a huge wooden stamp on it, a bit like a visa stamp. And this work is all about the circulation of, of, of people and how um, there are a lot of problems when people want to migrate and move um, countries in the world, especially if they're from Africa. And uh, the, the bag symbolised the, the, the people um, and then the visa stamp is, is that kind of um, the, the show of bureaucracy. Are they going to let are they going to let you in or not? So. I'm really excited about this piece and this piece um, is being made in Cameroon from Cameroonian wood, these huge big wooden chairs. As I said, they're nearly five metres high and that presents a challenge about how we actually get them to Manchester. They'll come apart into two bits so they will actually fit into our, into our lift, into our building. But before that they need to come on a huge big container uh, by sea from Cameroon and they need to leave quite soon in a couple of weeks time in order to get here for our opening on the 1st of June. So I'm really looking forward to the artist when he actually arrives and he'll start to make the work in our space and we'll be able to see it taking shape. It's so exciting working with artists that are making brand new things because you don't really know what they're going to look like until they're actually made. So I'm one of a number of people that is working on this show and over the course of the next few weeks you'll hear from many of my colleagues both from Manchester Art Gallery and the Whitworth who will tell you a bit about the bit that they're working on whether it be someone from the conservation team who's looking after the work or someone from our collection management team who's working on the transport or somebody who's um, helping with the interpretation and writing the labels from the curatorial side um, or authoring the text for the catalogue. So there's a huge amount going on and um, I'm sure you'll be interested to hear what some of my colleagues have to say.